from some of our visits over to the school library, some of the children, one little girl in particular, got really interested in a sunflower garden that we found along the way. So one time the school decided to plant a sunflower garden and on one of our visits to the library it was new. So they were so interested into it. So we stopped by on the way to our library and had a look. They could see the bees getting the nectar from the sunflower. Um, when we came back to kindy, they were talking about it the whole trip back. So they were constantly talking about what they'd seen over at the library. So when we got back, we really brought that out. We, so we extended on those interests and we started talking about the life cycle of a plant, of a flower, and that led into building our own garden that we have. We planted marigolds and we planted sunflowers and they really started getting involved in doing that and building it up and making our garden beautiful, just like they saw over at the school. Kindy friends, we're going to talk about what we did last week when we went over to prep and we visited our prep classrooms and met our new prep teachers. So can we pop on our thinking caps, tie them on tight, and I want you to think about what did we do while we were over at prep? What's something that you loved experiencing when we were over there and having a go at? What about you, Lexi? What did you love about prep? Of walking there. You loved walking over to prep. It was a lovely walk, wasn't it? It was nice and cool that day. We love walking over to prep. Can anyone remember what garden the school have planted over at the big school? Evie, do you remember what they planted? Sunflowers. Sunflowers, they did. They have a beautiful sunflower garden. So lovely. So from that, we've tried really to not shy away from using the proper language. So we already had learnt earlier in the year about a meteorologist who is the weatherman. Um, so from that, we then carried that on and learnt more about a person who looks after gardens. So we started speaking about horticulturists. So each day we have a horticulturist who comes and collects water in the watering can and they go around and they tend to all of our gardens and make sure they have everything they need with the water and the sunlight. And we don't shy away from using that language because even though they're kindergarten children, they're really capable of understanding that and they remind us every day. They always know we need to set up our job person, we need a weatherman, so the meteorologist, and we need a horticulturist, and we need a zoologist, and they love that on a daily basis. What else can you remember about I your classroom? I remember they had plants. They had plants? Yeah. Wow. Do they have plants inside of the classroom or outside? Outside. Outside, growing in the ground? Yeah. Do you think you might water the plants there? Yeah. Yeah? Do you remember what job is the person who waters plants, who takes care of plants? Do you remember what he's called? Yeah. What's he called? Um. Do you remember it starts with H? Horticulturist. A oh, horticulturist, good job. They water plants. I wonder if you'll get to be the horticulturist over at prep. Mm-hmm.